Thanks for watching this clip from my new podcast, In Search of Soil. For more great clips and full episodes, check out the links in the description below. Given your chemical engineering background and chemistry background, do you have any thoughts on this? Termination of cover crops with an herbicide, is there any sort of comparison in terms of the soil on a herbicide terminated cover crop versus in an organic system, which uses, say, a mechanical means to terminate that same cover crop? In other words, is, are the soil microbes being affected at all in your studies? Have you seen anything like that by that herbicide? Right. I, I've not done any sort of um, comparisons. If you'd have asked me five years ago, I would have said that tillage is always more destructive than herbicides. Um, I spent two days with uh, Dr. Don Huber out in Emporia, Kansas at Gail Fuller's field school. And I got the living daylight scared out of me as he spoke about a Roundup and then all the adjuvants that are part of it. So, so I think we're in a world right now where we um, we're dealing, or we don't even know what some of the unintended consequences are of some of these chemicals that we have. Many of them, you know, I, th I, I believe Roundup is just the poster child, but many of these things are uh, chelators, and they're chelating a lot of the essential minerals that we have. Um, and uh, Francis Chaboussou wrote a book called Healthy Plants, where he brought up a, a, a thing of trophobiosis. And basically his thing was that the chemicals that we're using and the excess nitrogen we're using actually just makes plants more tasty for pests because pests are essentially the, the demolition crew, and they come in and demolish plants that are unhealthy. Um, I also hear of anecdotal evidence that pest pressure now is way higher than it used to be. So it makes me think that gradually we have um, become used to systems that are so full of pesticides and plants that are extremely unhealthy, so they're very unhealthy. So what do we have to do? Well, they're attacked by pests. What do we have to do? We have to spray them. Um, what does that do? That lowers the photosynthetic activity in the plant, uh, which makes it more susceptible to, um, to pest species. So I think we're in kind of a downward spiral there. And... Um, so again, going back, I don't have comparative numbers, so I, I couldn't speak authoritatively on that, but I have a suspicion that um, our production agriculture system uh, has moved us to more and more unhealthy soils. And I, you know, I don't know whether certain kinds of tillage systems, and I know this is sacrilege to my soil health brothers and sisters, but you know, are there tillage systems that may be less destructive than some of the herbicides that we're using? So it's a, it's a question that I would have been absolutely on the side. No, we need to use herbicides because tillage is extremely damaging. Now I'm not 100% sure on that. But I think there are unintended consequences when we use herbicides and pesticides. Thanks for watching this clip from my new podcast, In Search of Soil. For more great clips and full episodes, check out the links in the description below.